I'm going to be showing you how to get the Flame Keeper title in the Solstice 2022 event. And there are quite a few event challenges in your event card that you just complete passively. An example of this is ability kills or super kills. And one thing you can do is use a shotgun with a hand cannon as well as using a solar subclass and getting ability kills at the same time. So you'll be able to complete four challenges at once. Another good combination is to do public events in the throne world while also doing patrols to complete three challenges at once. For the Dare to Dream challenge, you should do tier three blind wells as you can also complete other challenges since you can get your super back faster and for the brightful challenge you should do heroic nightfalls as they give you 10% completion for every run and the most annoying challenge to complete is called the fires of competition and you have to do 25 crucible or gambit matches so i'd recommend to just six stack in the most fastest game mode so this would be mayhem and you could also try mercy people and for the next triumph it's called spark in the dark and i'd recommend to do altars of sorrow as it will give you 7% per wave and to gild the seal you should have passively completed the bonfire bash triumph and for this you needed to stoke the bonfire in the bonfire bash activity and the second triumph which you might have done passively is called the inextinguishable and you need to complete the bonfire bash activity without dying the third triumph to gild the seal is called from the ashes and for this you have to upgrade 12 pieces of candescent armor and this is referring to the silver ash so you need to upgrade your armor so you can have a plus 20 stat then the final triumph is called the incandescent and for this you should definitely farm the boss checkpoints of the dungeons and you'll need a fully rekindled armor set to do this and now you know how to get the flame keeper title you also need to know how to get triple 100 armor stats from the sources event efficiently